Welcome to the channel. Help me hit 600 subscribers. Now let's go to the video. What happened to Cristiano Ronaldo and 11 other players to leave Manchester United under Eric Ten Hag? Eric Ten Hag has seen 12 senior players leave Man United permanently since he took charge of the club in 2022. Eric Ten Hag is only in his second summer in charge of Manchester United, but he has ruled with an iron fist. Twelve senior players have left the club since he took charge last year and that doesn't include the likes of Wout Weghorst, Marcel Sabitzer, and Jack Butland who all left after loan spells. Ten Hag have slowly raised the club back to its traditional standards after a decade of mismanagement and that means a lot of departures. He wants United to be even more ruthless in the summer, which has already seen three players leave and many players could have their heads in the block after underwhelming campaigns. Harry Maguire, Alex Tells, Eric Bailey, Dean Henderson and Brandon Williams were all destined for sales, while David De Gea, Dean Henderson, Scott McTominay, Fred and Donny van de Beek have uncertain futures. See how the 12 players who have left United so far in the Ten Hag reign have fared since the match. Cristiano Ronaldo, the biggest match of Ten Hag's reign so far is easily Cristiano Ronaldo. It was clear from the start that the United legend did not suit Ten Hag's system and so the relationship gradually declined. After some controversy, Ronaldo sealed his fate with an explosive interview that led to the mutual termination of his contract. With no European club wanting to sign him, he went to Al Nasser in Saudi Arabia, where he is often thwarted, but has 14 goals in 19 games. Paul Pogba Paul Pogba's turbulent second spell at Old Trafford finally came to an end when his contract ran out and he returned to Juventus. His return to Turin has not been planned so far as he has spent most of the campaign on the sidelines. He didn't play his first game until February and further setbacks meant he only managed 10 games. Andreas Pereira, the only player United actually managed to sell for a decent price last summer was Andreas Pereira, who joined Fulham for around £9 million. The Brazilian had an unexpectedly great campaign and became one of the main men in Marco Silva's team, contributing 11 goals in 38 games. Juan Mata Although for a moment it looked like Juan Mata might stay at United for another year, it was eventually decided that he would leave after his contract expired. The Spanish star left for a season in Turkey and played 18 times as Galatasaray won the league. Nemanja Matic Nemanja Matic took everyone by surprise when he announced that he would be leaving United for free as his contract had a clause that could end a year earlier than expected. He was reunited with Jose Mourinho at Roma and enjoyed a good season that ended in a heartbroken defeat to Sevilla in the Europa League final. Jesse Lingard, as he was a year ago, Jesse Lingard sees himself as a free agent. The striker ended his long relationship with United and joined Nottingham Forest, but has made little impact and is now looking for another club. Edinson Cavani, after a second season marred by injuries and extended breaks in South America, Edinson Cavani's time at United ended on a disappointing note. He took his itinerant career to Spain to sign for Valencia for free, scoring seven goals in 28 appearances. Lee Grant Grant ended his career last year after spending the last three seasons as a first-team senior for United. He joined former United manager Kieran McKenna at Ipswich as manager and helped Tractor Boys win promotion back to the championship. Zidane Iqbal Promising midfielder Zidane Iqbal failed to break into Ten Hag's side last season and with Kabi Mino leapfrogging him in the pecking order, he opted out. United could only manage a fee of less than £1 million for the 20-year-old, who joined Dutch side Utrecht. Phil Jones, after spending 12 years at Old Trafford, Phil Jones has quietly ended his time at Old Trafford following the expiration of his contract. The defender has been ravaged by injuries in recent years and has yet to find a new team to play for. Axel Tuanzebi, another central defender who has had problems with injuries is Axel Tuanzebi. The academy graduate already looked destined to be a regular in the team, but his progress was halted by setbacks and unsuccessful loan spells at Aston Villa, Napoli and Stoke saw United allow his contract to expire. Hope you enjoyed the video. What did you think of the video? Subscribe to the channel and leave your opinion in the comments.